Okay, what I wanted to show here is this is a water filter, um, but there's no filter in it at the moment. Um, this is where it comes in from the well. And what we, well, with iron bacteria, we took the filter out because it starts stinking about after two weeks, even though it, there's not much on it, but it still starts stinking. And then the other thing I wanted to share is uh, what we did for a while is we stuck this uh, screen filter and we stuck it kind of basically in the top where the basically where the <clears throat> output goes to the rest of the house and then we would collect big larger particles because it's just a uh, stainless I'm, I think it's a stainless steel screen okay and again just wanted to show you where this came from because for later you'll we're gonna I wanted to show some like iron bacteria on this that developed on this screen which I think is iron bacteria anyway Okay, right here we have the screen. Um, I just wanted to show there's some. I tried cleaning this and I cleaned it in bleach. It was. Uh, you'll find later we had some of this. There's a little sample right there, in the upper left corner, of what I believe is iron bacteria, but it's a different kind. Um, and here you see some more where I couldn't really get the screen totally clean. And you'll see these little white part of, or strings. Um, or roots and they, they really want to interweave themselves along that steel screen um, and this was also when I was cleaning this I had it in bleach uh, the full concentration of bleach and then I was scraping scraping and the stuff was so you know weaved throughout the uh, basically the screen and then you can see some more of these white uh, stringy like uh, particles um, which I believe is another form of uh, iron bacteria, but it's not like the slime bacteria. This stuff is tough. I mean, you get enough of this together, which I'll show later, it, it, it's almost like a cloth. Okay, here's the material that I scraped out of the uh, screen and grouped it together. And you can kind of see it's kind of stringy and you can see some light orange. It wasn't quite that orange. It was mostly white when I first got it, but now it seems to have turned a little more orange uh, since then. And there's, you'll see some other particles trapped on it, but it's very stringy, and it just interweaves with itself. And, and I mean, this stuff can really clog a screen. And here I'm just kind of zoom magnifying it, and just kind of you can see some of that orange rust-type color there. And then you see a little bit more. And it's kind of... And I have to kind of like zoom in and, well, bring the height of the uh, scope, USB scope, up and down because of the difference in uh, height of this. Okay, here's some trapped particles. And I believe some of that is actually just uh, iron from the uh, casing of the well. Because uh, I have taken a magnet and this stuff is magnetic. It follows, the, you know, when you're moving the magnet around at the bottom of the filter that, I, we, that we saw earlier in the video. So those I think are just iron casing chips there. And there you can see some more how that stuff is just so crystal, I mean clear, like fine clear tubes that it grows. And then there's some orange that develops on it later. So it's just kind of interesting uh, stuff because I'm not quite sure if I, I'm pretty, I think it's another type of iron bacteria and that's what I'm hoping somebody else can chime in and uh, confirm because it does show the rust and it certainly grows in the screens quite well and you can kind of see a little more here now here it was came from another owner's well uh, it was a Morton salt uh, filter they got from Menards and the whole filter on top was just plugged and this is just, if you feel or touch this stuff, it feels just like cloth. It's so interweaved. Uh, these roots, like, it can be like roots or strings that are intertwined. But it's not real slimy like the uh, slime bacteria in an earlier video on how we did it 500. If you go to the channel page, if you want to take a look at. This stuff seems to be more like roots in the interweave. And then I'm just kind of zooming in and out here on different uh, heights trying to focus on and then there's particles trapped in there um, some of that could be uh, the well casing uh, this could just be sediment or just whatever gets through the filter screen so but this was like five years 
uh, in the screen uh, just soaking up and so that certainly affected the water pressure I mean it was like that was one of the complaints of this particular well owner was this uh, didn't have a lot of water pressure so just kind of going along here and I'm going to be coming to the end here and I just wanted to share what I found and hopefully somebody will find this helpful to them and maybe know if this is truly also another form of iron bacteria so I uh, guess uh, thanks for watching